you were saying you're a member of the National Bee Board. Yes. Tell. I, I, I'm, uh, I'm, uh, I have a membership with them. So, till 26. Very good. Very good. So, that's, uh, and I want to promote this beekeeping in Goa. Show us around. Yeah. Come. So, th this is... This is the stingless yeah. what I showed you, yeah. but for Serena, you will require the veil one minute. Okay, okay. Can you pause? Yeah, sure. Carry on, carry on, don't worry. So, we are in Kojo in Aldona. You have to be covered? Yes, yes, I will require the veil. Cool. I give you also. Yeah, one. yeah. Kojo, former island, now bridged in Aldona. A very rustic setting and Savio is showing us his Trigona stingless bees okay, this is the this is how it looks it's like real rustic setting really nice cool breeze blowing on a March afternoon March evening yep yeah Okay, so I have to wear all this, huh? Yes. No problem. Okay. okay. It's uh, just for your safety. Yeah. Your safety. So this is how I look. Oh, wow. Fantastic. So it doesn't... Very nice. Touch. And you, <laughs> if you wear a long uh, sleeves uh, yeah. shirt, that will do. Okay. And the gloves. Okay. You might not require because I'll okay. be yeah, handling touching. them. Okay. No problem. So... <laughs> wow. Interesting. Very interesting. Very interesting. <laughs> this is me. So that's that. Amazing, no? At one stage, Goa lived in its villages. Today, our villages have become dormitories for us. Yes. We only uh, sleep in them and uh, we don't do anything productive. Maybe some internet based work from home stuff. It's so amazing what you're doing, Savio, because I think it's very important and more people need to know about this. You are most welcome to come and give us a talk in our village. We would really appreciate. Sure. sure. We would really appreciate. So people can approach you also, Savio, for, for yes, hives? Directly for hives. you can, but any time, like, you know, if you want colonies, then okay. I require lead time. Because yeah. it doesn't happen overnight. 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 Understood. Okay. Followed. This, this is the queen cage. Oh, wow. See, if you when you go to capture, you yeah. can uh, take the queen and put it uh, in this. I see. So what happens? The queen cannot come out. Yeah. Only the worker bee can go inside. I, the worker bee can go Workers inside. Bees can because the queen size, size behind abdomen is fat. Okay. So she cannot pass through it. My goodness. So this is the queen. And without cage. the queen, the hive can do nothing. No, nothing means what happens? The colony collapses because there is no laying inside. Okay. By by the meantime, they'll uh, if there is the colony is queenless, then they'll make a queen. Okay. From the cell, yeah. whichever is like you know close by within uh, one two days three days when she has laid, yeah. suddenly it goes off. They see, they'll make a they, they change the they change the gender. Yes, so they will start feeding uh, royal jelly. <laughs> so that's her feed, royal this, jelly. This looks like going politics, yeah. <laughs> and no. with the royal jelly, the the gender will change. <laughs> Gender will change means what happens, they give the feeding, different feeding, yeah. because uh, normally the workers' bees are, uh, live on pollen yeah. and nectar and all, but uh, she is fed royal jelly. My goodness. So that also, this is the gate actually, we use it for the hives, Yeah. the whatever boxes we put, yeah. we put it in front of the, this is the queen Science gate. Science Kubamare, very interesting field, yeah, almost like a game. <laughs> then I wish I'll more people knew of this. Then I'll show you, see, and when we ex extract honey, yeah. we have a extractor over here. Yeah. Extractor. Yeah. This is the extractor water. Okay. Made where? Made where? This is actually made, uh, this is from Karnataka. Okay. Okay, from the other state. They are very, very innovative. Yes. Huh? yes. And they are doing on a larger scale, no? Yeah. So we can do it also, Correct. not a problem because I had open, I have to just tighten the okay. screws, okay. The, that's it, otherwise it will press be. And, and the honey will be extracted. No, no. what happens is, see, when you are, when we want to extract, there is no bee which is hurt or which will die. I see. You have to drive them away from the frame and put the frame inside, I'll show you one frame here. Before that. Yeah. See. 
Yeah. There are there are two types of frame. Okay. This is the brood. Brood frames means that they are bigger one. Okay. Where she lays the eggs. Okay. The combs are there. She lay the eggs. We don't remove these frames. Yeah. They are always there for the egg laying. Yeah. yeah, egg laying. Yeah. We don't touch. When when uh, the these uh, frames are full in the box. Yeah. We put the super. There's another uh, this thing where we put the small frames. On this combs, what they make, they won't lay any eggs. It will be totally for honey. So when uh, we remove it, we can put it like this okay, directly okay. in the extractor. Amazing. So it goes. Four, this is a four frame extractor. I see. So and then you just turn it okay, around. Okay. Like you know. Okay. 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 Like this. It is yeah. clockwise and anti-clockwise. I see. And then and the honey will spill. I see. So you have to with the centrifugal motion, the honey yes, will. Yes. 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 So. Spill out. What happens is uh, when it is sealed, you have to just slice it uh, the outer okay. layer, uncap it, okay. and put it in this. I see. And uh, do the My spinning. My goodness. That's it. Wow. <laughs> it's simple. It is not uh, rocket, rocket science. science. <laughs> what the same goes. Yes. So and this is a smoker which you might require sometimes, okay. like you know where you put a coconut husk. Yeah. Okay. So and then you light it with it. Yeah. And you want to because sometimes. It is always better, like you know, you smoke the bees okay. first outside, so that they are calm, cool. Okay. You know, they get cool with this. Yes, smoke with the smoke. So then you can work, you know, coolly. I see. I thought they Anna, get dazed with it. No, cool means they are cool inside. Okay. You know what happens is like you know, they don't even if they are aggressive, they will because the it uh, the smoke breaks the. Whatever signal they give, I see. It's a break-in signal. Really? Yes. So <laughs> signal to each other. To each other, because once they sting, they give a signal saying attack. There's a danger. Attack. Oh. So then the other bees come and really? they attack. On wherever the one has attacked, they'll attack you. My. That is goodness. only in the, in case in case of Serena. Okay. Or the rock bees. Okay. In in case of rock bees also, like you know, uh, Serena, you go two steps backward. Yeah. Then. They will not do much attack, but in in case of uh, rock, rock bees. bees, they can chase you up to two kilometers, really? three kilometers. Really? They will be. They are very aggressive. I remember this story in school. We were in Britos in seventies, yes. late seventies, okay. and there was a beehive outside. One boy just to see what could be done, he threw water on it. Okay. The bees went down to Mapsa Market, which is a good three kilometers, okay. two and a half, two kilometers away, and stung the teachers who were going home. Oh. oh, oh, oh. So the boy got suspended, unfortunately. Come, 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 See, they are going in and out. You can see. Yeah. One minute, I'll get a lighter. Normally, I handle without smoke also. Okay. But you should be very careful, like you know how to handle them. Okay. And once you get the uh, hang, hang of, of it, it. now. Then it's not a scary big, thing. Yeah, no, not not a problem. And the sting is also good for like you know, they say it's good for arthritis. Oh my God! So what what happens is it's it's just smoke like this. Yeah. Pura titla pura. Yeah, yeah, not much. You know, otherwise they don't do anything. Everything depends on handling. How you handle the bees. Okay. So now we are going to open this box. Yeah. Okay. So you can. See. They don't do anything. See. Yeah. I'm touching them. <laughs> yeah. So, see, as I told you, the smaller frames. In this, there is a frame which is a honey frame. Oh wow. See how they are making, and inside whatever they stored, you know. Yeah. yeah this and then they'll seal it like this. Hard working guys, yeah. Yes, you see them how they are working. Otherwise, normally they don't do anything. 
Okay. You have to handle properly. Okay. You should not, uh, you know, um, press in a hard way yeah, like yeah, where they yeah, will yeah, sting. Yeah. Okay. Otherwise, they are doing their job. Yeah. See, now they are sealing it. Once they seal, means they have removed the moisture. Okay. And it is a pure honey. My goodness. So what happens once they remove uh, the moisture? There is no water content. Okay. It is very less. No, yeah. the moisture. Uh, this otherwise, first in the rains you can't keep this out. No. You have to put a covering on top. Okay. I normally put a metal sheet. Okay. See, this is how they are making the comb. This I am developing now, this colonies. I see. see. That always the top part is the honey. See, yeah. yeah. See, this is the top part. They keep yeah. honey. Okay. In any hive, any means uh, any breed, the top is always honey. Okay. Then they will start laying eggs. Okay. And somewhere pollen. See, this I is see. the pollen. I this see. yellow. You can see. I see. Yellowish. Yeah, 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 yeah. That is the yeah. pollen and eggs. I'll show you. Each, each is a colony with its own queen. Yes. With its own queen. With its own queen. One minute. I'll Solid caste system. Hamar uh, Yes. Huh? They, they have. <laughs> and they don't fool around and all, no. See now, the bees. No, no, no. Now the bees from this colony will not go in this colony. My goodness. Because, because what happens is membership if, card. If, if membership take, card. Yes. Because it, they know, like you know. Where they, they belong. Where they belong. They can like, go from one to the other. They can go from one colony, one hive to the other. But they will not allow, no. Because no, here, here I'm saying from one to yeah, the yeah, other. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. They'll move in the full uh, this thing. They'll move as as the work is allocated. See the work is allocated. Yes, because they have a uh, work allocation inside. No, hey. some will be uh, nurse bees. Some will be everything. The day they are born, everything is allocated. Then there will be foragers who will bring only My the goodness. nectar. Someone will bring uh, pollen. Then they'll remove it. They'll remove it. If you see any uh, this thing, other bee will take it from him. What so, sociology? Yeah. Yes. So they are working all together like you know it's a uh, teamwork. How many hours work? They work uh, mostly full day. day. You can say sunlight. Yes, sunlight. Night time I've not seen them. <laughs> Because they don't go out, no? Yeah. They are in, inside, but I don't know. As uh, they say, like, you know, they go to sleep, they say. Okay. But they will be inside. And even if there is heat, no, they might be uh, doing the fanning part of it, the wings. Really? Yes. Yes, you can see. To keep home cool? What is that? To, to keep inside the... Because there is a certain temperature maintained temperature. between the frames and all. Okay. See, I'll show you. See, these are the eggs. The top part is the honey, as I told you. No? Yeah. They have sealed it. Then, there are eggs here. See, these are all eggs. I see. Which are sealed. They will hatch as the days go by. Yeah. So, that's this thing. And if you handle it properly, you know, yeah. there should not be any fear. They will move around, hover around, not yeah. a problem, see. Yeah. Now if I lift my hand, they are coming on top. Yeah. And you don't have to worry. See, this was also like that, full of, full of eggs. But okay. now it is like, you know, they have hatched. Yeah. And you can see it's open. The queen yeah. will lay again eggs okay. in that. Okay. They'll clean it. So the queen Teal. has an enormous potential to lay eggs? Yes. Millions? Uh, this is the queen. Which one? See, I have marked my queens. Yellow with the... How you mark them? I have a marker, special Ali. marker. See, the fat abdomen is yeah. fat. Yeah. Queen. Yes. Here. Yeah. yeah. You can see, no? Yeah. All my queens are marked. Really? Yes. I mark them first only. Wow. So that's what I do. Because in... in any time I want to do something, first I check the queen, where she is. Then I try to handle that frame properly. Okay. Keep them around. See, now they are In this around. box, how many queens are there? Uh, only one. Only, only one, one. Only one queen in a box. This is one colony. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. That, that's it. Hmm. So then they, they'll keep on, uh, you know, build, build, building combs, like, you know, we have given them uh, frames. Yeah. So on each frame, they are building the combs. Yeah. These combs. 
actually I put a small piece of for them to start. You put? Y yes, of their wax only. Okay. So once uh, once once they this thing, they'll keep on continuing uh, continuing making a comb, full comb, and they make a this like this a full comb. Very interesting. I'll, I'll show you the smaller comb in the other. So, so you, uh, is it better to hold a talk there or to invite people here for the talk? See, for demonstration and all, uh, for this colony, Serena, yeah. you have to go wherever there is a colony. Because I cannot take this colony. Correct. I can uh, ship them only during night time. Yeah. If I want to take to Saligao, yeah, yeah, I, can, yeah, yeah. I have to take it only during Correct. night time. So people can come here but they need the clothes and all that, no? Yeah, no, see I have my colonies, they can come to Algona. It's better like, you know, first time it's always good to wear the, your veil. Okay. Because what happens? Fear. Some fear. See, there, there is a certain, everything, they are moving in and out. Yeah. Everywhere, they are going. Yeah. This is this is the one colony. I see. And I put a super for this. Once once the honey, this brood I don't touch uh, uh, for honey. Yeah. Okay. There there is a small super above this which fits one. I'll I see. show you how it fits. Yeah. Lots of science, huh? plenty of science. Is yes. It? And they work, you know, you and I, <laughs> there is no... Divisions, fight. no yes. divisions. No divisions, no fight. This is like, you know, once that... Uh, once the brood is full, yeah. then you keep on starting uh, putting these frames for honey. I see. So, and uh, this is the cover. Ah, you put more and more frames. More, yeah, more and more frames. So they'll keep on building up. <laughs> so that's how it is. So now one super, if the area is good, the flowering pattern is good in your area, then you'll come to know that it is full, one. Then you can put another super, then three supers, wow. four supers. And you, you can carry on. I see. Amazing. Hold on. So, and you cover this because cover this, keep it. So only during the breath period, what I said, you might have to give sugar feeding I for these bees. I see. For stingless, you don't have to worry. You just uh, shut it, <laughs> peel it, shut it and forget I it. see. So what happens is like, you know, they then manage by themselves. Okay. But for this, what happens if they don't get pollen nectar? Yeah. Then they abscond. Okay. So that's how, how it is. And then you can multiply also. Okay. You want to see? I'll show you this colony also. Yeah. Like, you know, how I start the, with the starter. This is a newer see? colony. What is that? This is a younger colony. Y yeah. No, no. What I do is uh, actually they are both uh, of the same in this thing. Okay. Okay. So uh, what happens is uh, some uh, remains a bit weak. Yeah. Then it depends, like you know, from where they get the nectar pollen. Okay. Okay. This is the time to stand this side yeah. right? because what happens if we are uh, blocking, obstructing, blocking, yeah, obstructing their oh. entrance. See, they are moving this way. They okay. are uh, most probably those flowers which are blooming there. You can see. Yeah. And the activity is uh, mostly, you know, uh, more in the morning and in the evening. Okay. Afternoon time, it will reduce. Hot because of the hot summer okay, okay. Uh, if it is uh, hot uh, in the uh, afternoon then the activity is very less i see whereas now they'll keep on going see the number of bees they are going yeah so i keep on adding frames yeah like this and sometimes what i do is if i want to make another split i yeah. take the help of this uh, colonies okay Okay, how I have given the starter is, you can say this. Right. This is the starter. They have X comb only. I see. Okay, so that's what I give them. They will and come they, and work on this. Yes. So, what they will do, do is, as the colony grows, yeah. they work on it. See, now th this will be... See. 
this three four days back I put. I see. I had put. So now they have. Wow. They they are building the combs. Okay. And they build you know one by one, not anyhow. Systematically. Systematically. First comb. We have so much to learn comb, from the second bees. Second comb. Yes. Very much. <laughs> then the third comb, fourth comb. They will not uh, leave okay. uh, and go to the fifth comb. I see. No, they will Discipline. work one by one. So that's how it is. My goodness. So in this also they will be cool. They keep on building, like you know. Yeah. See one, this comb they have made it this way. I see. So it is their internal structure, whatever <laughs> the management <laughs> is. Who decides? That is the worker bees. They do it. No, I don't know. Uh, the queen starts laying, and then uh, the, she allocates them. Okay. So there will be others who will be guiding. See now oh, this yeah. queen. You can see the queen, no? Yeah. This yellow. Yeah, yellow in the middle. Yes, dot. Yeah. Don't don't put your hand okay. because what happens sometimes they see it as a threat. Yes, threat, and then they sting. Okay. That's why I wear gloves. Okay. Otherwise, you can handle without gloves also. I see. But you should be very like you know experienced, confident. Yeah, confident, so that even if they come close, yeah. Once they they are used to like you know, then no problem. Now here they have built a side comb which I have to remove. Okay. Now, what they have done is. That, that's why you require the smoke. Yeah. Because this is the you know heavy movement of their traffic is moving yeah. faster. Yeah. yeah. So the activity is more. Right. You can make out. Yes. Yes. Moment, no. I'm obstructing them, no. Yeah. I'm troubling them. Actually, best time is like you know, twelve o'clock, one o'clock, two o'clock. So they are working inside. See, suddenly they have made this side comb. Okay. You know, yeah. One okay. Minute, I'll show you from here. Okay. This I have to remove it. Okay. You know, I'll with the knife I'll remove it. I see. So that I give them, like you know, the proper management. Right. Because otherwise, afterwards, what happens to remove it becomes a problem. Okay. Understood. So then they will stick to some other comb. So this is fascinating. Yeah. Fascinating. And basically.